Okay, so today we're going to make ceviche. It's a traditional South American dish, but what we're actually going to do is use the trout from the river test here. It's going to take about 10 minutes, and really all it is is fish, loads of flavour, a bit of texture, and then some acidity in the form of lemon and lime to cook it. So let's go. What I've got here, some of Lee's trout, which I've actually taken the skin off. So nice little fillets, de-skinned, and we've got a nice chunk there. And this is dead simple, right? So what it is, is going to be some fish, acidity, lemon, and then some lime juice I've already squeezed. Some spice, a bit of chilli, and a bit of flavour. A bit of onion, coriander, whatever you want really. I've got a pepper here, and really, it's just an assembly job. So dead quick, nice and easy, and actually pretty tasty. So what I'm going to do first of all, is get my bowl. I've got some spring onions here. You can make it as neat, or as rough as you like really, because we're by the river we should probably go quite rough, shouldn't we? So nice bit of spring onion in there. I've got this stuff from earlier. And some red chilli. Just de-seeded these. And I'm just going to go finely slice red chilli. So a bit of red chilli in there like that. Let's go for three, shall we? Awesome. Trout, as fresh as it comes, straight out of the river behind me. This is actually a South American, like, peasant food, really. It's what the fishermen eat when they come into shore. You find all these little shacks up by the shore, and they're just serving their catch. It's just the off-cuts of fish, and because it's so easy to cook, they can have a meal within seconds. So there we are, nice bite-sized chunks of trout in the bowl like that, pretty rustic looking. So now, all you really need to do actually is think about how we're going to cook the fish and that's using the acidity of these. I've already squeezed a load of limes in there and we'll use some lemon as well. Right, so quantity wise, enough to cover the fish really and it doesn't take long. It takes maybe two and a half, three minutes and that's all you need and it just basically, similar to the Gravelax, it just starts to cure and almost cook the fish. And you can serve it how you like. Basically, they can um, serve it wet when it's almost like a soup, a lime juice soup. But I prefer when it's dry, so you're actually going to take this out and then serve it like that almost. Anyway, I'm getting ahead of myself. That's the liquor there ready. Most important thing, salt. Plenty of salt in there. Give it a stir around. I'm just going to, have to use my knife. Get this ready, so mix it all up and once you start this process you've got to be ready to do everything else. So in a second I'm going to pour that in there and then in three minutes I'm going to, have to chop up some onions and get some peppers ready. So let's go. If you're doing this at home, probably put it in the fridge now but it's a nice autumn day so it's nice and cool out here. Make sure that's really well coated. smell that already, it smells amazing. Right, so garnish wise, whatever you want really, whatever floats your boat. I'm going to just use a bit of onion, just finely sliced red onion. And probably the most important ingredient, coriander. We'll leave it quite rough to go with the theme. There we go. And this will be good, just a bit of thinly sliced red pepper for garnish. Beautiful, right. I reckon another 30 seconds there. You can see now that fish is starting to turn almost opaque. And basically, it is basically cooking in that liquid. The acidity of the lime and the lemons there, just turning that now. You can feel a certain stiffness coming into it. And that is absolutely amazing. Okay, bit of avocado, bit of texture to go against the hardness of the fish. I reckon we've got about 30 seconds. So the key here is preparation. Get everything ready, and then it's like one big assembly job at the end. Right, here we go. So, fish mixture, 
So I prefer it dry, so just a nice bit of the fish there. Look at that, beautiful. Bit of coriander, actually I'll tell you what, a bit of onion just sprinkled over the top there. A few slices of avocado. Bit of pepper. And finish it all off. Just some fresh coriander. Look at that. Beautiful river test trout. Cooked ceviche style with avocado, coriander, and loads of other bits and bobs. Absolutely amazing. I'm talking rubbish. <laughs> <laughs>